Chubbs just hit a three. <sighs> Man. Okay. Oh, wait. Let me pull this closer. Ow. Oh, God. Dang. Camille really got hurt. Oh, that's out on him. That's us. Man, that was that was such a great win. Well, it wasn't a great win. It was a win we were supposed to, that was supposed to happen because of this hard stretch coming up. And it, uh, yeah, um, let's look at the box score real quick. Um, yeah, sorry, I couldn't do the uh, Toronto, what's it called game? Toronto Warriors to Toronto game. That was uh, that was weird. That was a good game by Kuminga. I knew I knew we were gonna lose, but it was just a really an evaluation game. I should have done a video, but yeah, Kuminga played well. He saw a few things, saw a few flaws. Lee got a touchback this game, though, man. He played. He played great. Damian Lee played great. Let me see. I think Damian Lee, yes, yeah, 7 for 8, 18 points in, I thought it said 11 minutes, in 30 minutes. 18 points in 30 minutes. And, like, dang, step shot. The 48, bro, what? I, I, I. Bro, I would never understand this guy. This guy is, like, I was just talking about him earlier. I'm like, bro, he is playing horrible. And because he was, like, 6 for 16, 1 for 7 on threes. I'm like, come on, man. Come on. What is this stuff? And then he has 15 in the fourth. <laughs> I knew he was going to heat up. He usually does, but it's like, I'm like, dang. He had 15 in the fourth, 3 for 4 on threes. Like, I, that is just incredible and we got we didn't like and while Steph was cold we got contributions from everybody Donald Porter Jr. should have had two blocks but the first one was a bull a bull crap call and then the second one was bull but we challenged it so it turned out to be a block but we didn't get the jump ball which is stupid we should just get the ball back like because it's a clean block and uh yeah but our auto porter he came in here tonight like everybody just everybody that's why this team is so great like Steph can have an off three off quarters and then come in in the fourth and score 15 because this team it can keep us in the game and keep the lead this team as a whole like just imagine we had clay this game this game probably would have been more of a blowout because we didn't because this game was closer than it should have been to be honest had Steph been Steph this game and he hit his open threes. He probably would have 40 50 tonight. He like this is like this is off Steph too. This is Steph shooting 48 percent. He should actually be shooting 60 tonight with all those open looks they were giving him. I was like, oh, he's going for 40. But hey, and then you got Iggy going two for four, three for five. Iggy always hits those two two shots were like big shots too, like big momentum shots and shots that just really ended the game. I'm like. Of like all his shots are just like shots like and then he had that behind the back pass the OPJ bro Iggy is just different but that's a top ten play that is a top ten play right there for real um come on Looney barely played this game man dang how many fouls did he have because we well, only had two I thought he was getting bullied I thought he was like I thought he like almost fouled out that's why he ain't playing but yeah dang that sucks that Kuminga only played six minutes tonight. Because he had that back injury. That was so stupid. Like, dang. He uh, he was in there the first quarter. And then he, then he didn't get a chance again. Like, he was playing great defense and great offense. Well, he's one for four, but he never got a chance. And then you do like, oh, dang, that, that sucks. I hope he's good, man. We need to rest. Uh, good thing we get two days off. Good thing the Warriors get two days off again, so... John Lee Kuminga can, can get his legs under him again. But, um, and then you got the player of the game. Well, let's talk about, before I get to the player of the game, uh, I want to talk about, uh, obviously, um, I was going to say Gary Payton. He's, like, Gary Payton is so good, man. Every time he's out there, he does something great. It's like, it's either a dunk, a steal, a hustle play. I'm like, dang. And he just, every time he's near the basket, it's like 100%. Every time, bro, except for that goal ten, that should have been a that should have been a score, but hey, hey, it didn't. Hmm. Okay, whatever the the refs were horrible tonight. Of course, again, yet again, the NBA somehow gives us two refs again. How does the NBA do this? Get, 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 what are the refs doing? Are they not vaccinated again? I'm like, bro, like I'm not vaccinated. I don't even know. I don't even know. How did they get? How did every time two straight games? We freaking get two reps again and when Steph plays. It's like, of course. 
I swear they're doing that on purpose so they won't have to give Steph foul calls, bro. Did he even get to the free throw line? Oh, yeah, he got to the free throw line once. And he missed it, bro. Because he... Steph was horrible outside of that board. And he is just... But Steph... I don't know. Man, it's like... Man, Nemanja had some two bad turnovers. Chioza is still kind of bad. I don't know what's going on. But one, he was good, but... Chioza, he just annoys me. He, he made no, his only shot in the fourth. He was really... Yeah, he was a negative one, too. I don't get how Juan was a negative this game. He was actually pretty good to me. But, yeah, my the player of the game is obviously Draymond, though. Draymond C. And his son. <laughs> and his son. His son was incredible. It was awesome. That one clip where he was giving the, his, uh, the shirt, the shooting shirt to Clay was funny. But, uh, but the player of the game. Oh, it's got to be Dray. Like, 16-point triple-double. His first triple-double this season. I, was exp I thought he was going to get 20, but that's not Draymond. He'd rather pass. But I'm like, he just, he played better than he was the, how was he a plus seven and Steph was a plus 16? That's just gravity right there. That is just gravity. Obviously, Andre's going to have the highest plus minus. Every time he's out there, something good happens. Except for that Knicks game, but he was breaking everything. But um, it's good to have Iggy back, bro. The team is so much better with him. I just hope we can somehow get Jordan Poole and Andrew Wiggins back for uh Saturday. Because it's like, I don't want to go on with this team. Because that's not even fair, bro. That wouldn't be fair. Um, But Draymond was a plus seven? How is he the same as Kuminga? He had a 16-point triple-double. Oh, he had five turnovers. He had five turnovers. I don't even remember the five turnovers. But he had 16 points, 10 assists, 11 rebounds, 2 blocks, 2 steals, an offensive rebound. One for two from three, seven of, seven of 11 from the field. Like, that's that's great, man. He is definitely the player of the game. I, like, and then, he's, then he's giving you all, all all generational defense as well. What the heck? Like, bro, this is the defensive player of the year right here. Like, I don't think anybody's better defensively than this guy. He can guard the perimeter, can block shots, get steals. He also runs the offense. High Q basketball player, the second best Big man passer in the league in my one of the best, like, I don't know. Top three. Top three big man passer in the league. It's like he's just absolutely incredible. Absolutely incredible. Yeah, give him his props. But I'll see you guys later though. Mm, yeah, that was a great win. We got Memphis. We got Memphis. We just lost to OKC tonight. <laughs> yeah, they just lost to OKC tonight. That uh sucks to be them. But they got job back. Of course they get job back. And of course Clay's not gonna return until January. I thought he was gonna return for this game or or the or Memphis, but hey, that's cool. Um, but yeah, we gotta play Memphis. I don't want to play them. I really don't like playing them. At least we're at home, but it's like, bro, they always like just get up and play at a hundred percent when they play us, man. I I just I really hope we get <laughs> Wiggins and pull back for those games, cause it's like for these next two, cause it's like we really need those two guys for these next two games to at least not get blown out because you know Ja is going to score 35 he's always going to get up for that and then you know the Suns want revenge for us breaking that 18 point game 18 point 18 game winning streak we beat them by 22 <sighs> yeah so we're 25 and 6 still no Clay Thompson still no Wiseman yeah, I just can't wait for them to come back. That we're gonna get even better with them. And we get two days of rest now until Memphis. But yeah, I'll uh I'll see you guys later. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Peace.